April's cold and snowy weather creating some challenges for people in our area who play spring sports. Or who want to. When yeah. the fields are covered, coaches have to get creative. Our Rose Schmidt is out on the patio with more. Rose? Well, Eric and Susan, how do you play a sport like golf or tennis indoors when you want to be outside enjoying the sunshine? Well, Middleton's athletic director tells me that you do strength and conditioning and you go over the rules of the sport, but sometimes that gets a little old. The sky is blue, the sun is shining. Play ball. Well, not exactly. <laughs> when the only concessions are coming from the ground and Mother Nature is the one stepping up to the plate. It's going to melt and it's like going to be 53 today, but then the field's wet and you can't play on that. It's causing some headaches for Bob Jors, who organizes athletics for Middleton High School. If the playing surface is not good, it, it is always a risk, whether you're in baseball, soccer, uh, lacrosse, whether it's too cold. But it's not just having students out in these conditions that worries him. It's also a risk for the fans. I mean, if the, the, the stadium may clear out of snow, but they may keep the bleachers very wet. So, yes, you do have to take all of those things into factor. Well, it's clear there's no fans watching baseball here and nobody is out here running track there aren't any matches being played around here today and speaking of tennis Kelly Schaefer has been Middleton's head coach for two years uh, it's just been confusing because people are never sure if we're gonna play or not and we kind of have to wait until the last minute to really tell them because we don't know and she's the one who's making that tough call. I'd say probably not. It's a gamble. <laughs> but Kala and her players are happy to bust out the rollers just to get the chance to be on the courts again. I think all of us have just been a little bit like, why is it so snowy this late into April? Usually we don't have to deal with quite this bad a season. But the sun is still shining, and by tomorrow, all of this could be gone. The Big 8 High School Conference does have a policy on weather for whether students can or can't play. Now, for a sport like tennis, it has to feel like at least 25 degrees. For baseball, it's 40 degrees. You know, at different sports, it's different amounts. But luckily, the sun is shining out here. It's much better out. 25-degree tennis. That sounds like a good time. <laughs> <laughs> little makeup games coming. Yeah, bless those for coaches. Sure. All right, thank you, Rose.